What's happening everybody? This is Phil from MDC. Hope everyone's doing well. Uh, welcome to another episode of Treasure Hunt Tuesday, guys. And uh, 2012 is a very, very strange, well, a bit of a different year for the treasure hunts. Um, as you, you, you're going to see when we go through it. It's a lot of cars. Um, it's kind of when Hot Wheels did... Uh, a change in the lineup okay we have 15 regular treasure hunts that they produced but they didn't produce the super treasure hunts for these 15 regular treasure hunts which kind of threw us collectors off because we started to notice mainline cars having rubber wheels okay and that really threw us in for a spin okay and the reason they did this is because it's the actual birth of what they call the secret super treasure hunt. Okay, so 2012 is the birth of the secret super treasure hunts. Okay, and which they followed it all the way uh, up until now uh, in 2022. They kept it this way and uh, it made the super treasure hunt. Uh, hunting a lot harder okay uh, so anyways it, 2012 was a real transitional year because you have your regular treasure hunts you have the secret super treasure hunts and then we were supposed to get the regular main lines that matched with the super secret treasure hunts okay which it was a real tough year I, I did not manage to get all the uh, the not regular treasure hunts. I have all the regular treasure hunts. I have all the super treasure hunts, but I don't have the regular version of the super treasure hunts. I don't have them all. But anyways, we're going to get this video going. I'm going to show you exactly, guys, what happened. Okay, so welcome to another episode of Treasure Hunt Tuesday, guys. All right. So, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to go through the regular treasure hunts. Okay, we're going to start off by doing that. Let me just adjust you guys properly here. You're a little bit off-sided. Okay, starting with number one, guys, regular treasure hunts. We do have the 41 Willis, okay? And there she is. Now, all these treasure hunts do not come with real riders as they are regular treasure hunts, okay? And this one is in a beautiful metallic brown and this car is just gorgeous guys okay you have the th logo on the side supports these beautiful five spokes we do have plastic base and that's the new th logo guys which it still bears today okay just that th and this one is a gorgeous gorgeous addition guys now the next one i guess i'll have to pull out let me see if I can find what goes with it because mine I don't know if I can find it guys sorry but I should be able to I should have pulled it out first and I did not and I think it's buried so I might not be able to show you guys which is a drag Okay, this is a shame. I should have been a bit more prepared, guys. But I wasn't. Anyways, the next one is the uh, Ducati 10, well, 1098, okay? And mine is broken. I have a brand new one in the, uh, in the case. But as you can see, Mine is broken, okay? I busted a front fork. And, yeah. Anyways, there's the Ducati. I do have a brand new one in the, the package, but I can't find it at the moment. So, as you can see, this one is in pretty bad shape, okay? But anyways, it is number two on the list. And it is the Ducati 1098. But, 
Anyways, this is not one of my favorite treasure hunts anyway, but it's scrapped. Number three, guys, we have the 69 Chevelle SS, and this one is gorgeous. Very beautiful two-tone color. Love the silver, the metallic, metallic green, and it sounds like my turntable is going to give out soon. Batteries are cooked again. And she is a beauty. Okay, we're going to have to go through these a little bit quick, guys, because there's a lot of cars to look at. Next on the list is the Ford GT in this red and white. Racing stripes looking awesome. Really, really sweet. Okay, next, you know what, let me see if I can find some batteries, guys, it's bothering me, hold on. Okay, sorry about that, guys, uh, I guess we're going to have to live with the noise, guys, because I cannot find any batteries for this uh, turntable, so bear with me, guys, and uh, we'll try and get through this, all right. Next in line, we have the 69 Corvette in this awesome blue racing stripes. Really super nice Corvette, guys. This is really well done. Got that beautiful chrome bumpers. Beautiful yellow-lipped wheels. This is just an awesome-looking vet. And, of course, we got the TH right beside the 62. Just a beauty, guys. Okay, the next one is the Tyrell, I believe. Tyrell P34. Six-wheeled racing car. Tiny, tiny little wheels in the front. Huge wheels in the back. Crazy looking vehicle. Now this vehicle here, guys, is all metal. Metal engine. Plastic base. So the engine is a separate piece altogether. Which is pretty cool. Got the Goodyear tires. That's a, just a pretty cool looking race car, guys. A little bit different. Now, the next car is gorgeous. We have the 67 guys Mustang. It's a custom Mustang, they call it. And this one is awesome with its silver and black and white decals. Blue-lipped wheels. This is a pretty cool-looking treasure hunt, guys. Very, very sweet. There's the TH logo on the back. Just a good-looking Mustang. Next in line is the 52 Chevy Pickup. Kind of a low rider look as well. Gold top. Burgundy. Pinstriping everywhere. This one has chrome front end, which is uh, metal, I believe. So it should have a metal base. Yeah, has a metal base, which gives it the side steps and the uh, front uh, grille. Got the TH logo on the back fender. And the color on this truck is really pretty cool. Now, the next one is probably one of my favorites out of this set. And we do have the Ferrari 430. Now, it's tough to say this name. Scuderia, I believe. Okay. Any of you... Uh, Italian uh, Ferrari fans out there can correct me on my uh, pronunciation, but I do believe it's the Scuderia or Scuderia. Not too sure, guys. Bit hard to pronounce, but it is the 430 Ferrari. And it is beautiful, guys. 
Love this car. You have full engine detail in the back. All interior done. I mean, she's just sweet. Very, very sweet, guys. Plastic base. And inserted headlights. Part of the windshield. This is a very gorgeous treasure hunt. Now, where's the treasure hunt symbol? I did not see that, actually. I don't know if they put the treasure hunt symbol on this one or not. I don't believe they did. Ah, there it is. Right there on the back. Right there. Pretty well hidden. Okay. Number. What number are we on? Ferrari. We are on number 10, which is the 65 Chevy Malibu. And this is another gorgeous car, guys. I really like this one. And once again, I believe it's metal because the front looks like it's metal. Let's check that base, guys. And it is a metal base, yeah. Which gives the chrome bumpers front and back. And this beautiful metallic olive green. And you have the treasure hunt symbol on the back trunk. This is a gorgeous car, guys. Really beautiful. There's your TH logo. Very sweet. Okay, number 11 is the Shelby Concept GTR1, I believe. The Ford Shelby GR1 Concept, guys. Now, this is a casting the Hot Wheels did not do a lot of. And it's a good looking car. Got your TH logo again on the back. Hot Wheels did a very good job on this car, guys. Really good job. Okay, the next one on the list is the 65... Ford Ranchero, guys, with a popping out engine, guys. So we do have the stacks coming through the hood, which is pretty different on a Ranchero, guys. But this is a gorgeous paint, okay? I mean, it is just a metallic flake, but this green is just something else. Now, whether you like the Ranchero or not, guys, this is pretty well done. You got the low rider wheels, these uh, spoked wheels. You have the lights in the back done. And you have this uh, crazy engine detail. Not too bad. Not too bad. Now, the next car is, I believe, the only non-licensed car in here. And it is the Surf Crate. And this is definitely a very strange looking car, guys. Not a casting I would collect, but it was a treasure hunt. I had to have it. And these are some crazy pipes on this car. Tiny little wheels in the front. Huge drag wheels on the back. Pretty cool looking car. But not something I would collect. The next one though is definitely something I collect. And we are definitely talking about the 92 Ford Mustang. Fox body guys. And this one is sweet. This is a gorgeous treasure hunt. Blue tinted windows. And they're pretty dark as well. Very, very sweet. 
Now the last one of these treasure hunts, guys, is the one that you can see there in the back. And yep, we are talking about the 60, no, 1970, guys, sorry. 1970 Chevelle convertible. And this one has red line wheels. And this pretty nice orange. Fully striped. TH on the quarter. Very nice little Chevelle. Now that's it for the treasure hunts, guys. Okay. Now we have the super secret treasure hunts, guys. Okay. And this is where it gets funny because Hot Wheels went completely the opposite way. And starting with number one, and remember, guys, this is in the same year. So number one, we have the Super Treasure Hunt Dodge Cornet Super B, 69. Now, we were confused as collectors because you would see this car and pass it up, but you wouldn't even think it was a Super until you started to look real close to it and see, hey, wait a second. We've got a TH symbol right there. And we have rubber wheels. Yet it's set in the exact packaging as the main line. As you guys know, because it's the way it is today. But it was a different turn. Because these regular treasure hunts that I just showed you guys had a green side package. So we knew it was a treasure hunt. These were completely random. So we were looking for the supers of the regular of these guys here. We were looking for the supers of these and they were never showing up. Instead, these were the supers. So this is number one. Number two is the Chevelle SS 396 67. Okay. And this is a super treasure hunt. And this one is the regular. Now, as I said, I don't have all the regulars of these supers. I'm missing a few. And the Dodge Cornette Super B being one of them. But as you can see, we started to see the difference. Hey, we have the regular version, and we have a super treasure hunt. So for night for for 2012, guys, we had three sets of 15 to collect, and I didn't realize it until later. So that'll be the Chevelle, guys. Number three on the list is the 1970 Camaro Roadway Race, what they called it, and this year. Is the Super Treasure Hunt. Has the TH logo on it. Now this one is a gorgeous car. This was really done beautifully. And as you can see. The difference from the regular. The regular did not get the stripes on the roof. And the hood. And did not get the TH. And obviously it didn't get the rubber wheels either, but. So this is how we started to see the difference, guys. And this is a beautiful car. Beautiful car, guys. Okay, the next one on the list is the Ford Falcon XB. And this gorgeous purple, red line wheels. That's a gorgeous super. And this one here, guys, I do not have the regular for either. Beautiful Spectra Flame Purple. Just sits pretty, this car. Next one, guys, is the 70, 67 Mustang Coupe. Okay. 67 Mustang Coupe. Yeah. 
with these gorgeous red line wheels and this Spectre Flame bronze copper. And this is a really, really nice car. And this one here, I do have the regular version of. And it came like this. So as you can see, there was a big difference. But once again, the regular does not have the stripes on the hood. And missing the TH. Very beautiful casting, guys. Very beautiful casting. Next one is a really gorgeous car, guys. And we are talking about the Dodge Challenger 71. This is just beautiful. Really, really super. Well, really, really super, super, guys. Beautiful blue paint. Again, has the red line wheels. This one is just stunning. And I do not have the regular of this one either. So as you can see, for this year, I'm missing quite a few of the regulars. Next in line is the Maverick Grabber. Or Gruber? Is it a Grabber? It's a Grabber. 71 Mustang Grabber. grabber. This one got the Hot Wheels logo. Side. Top. And it's a metallic blue. Got the TH over the Hot Wheels. And the regular version I do have. And it's right here. Now this one went from a purple to a blue. It's a kind of a bit of a different color. The regular got a metallic purple. And the Super got... Like a small well, kind of a Spectra Flame Blue, I guess. And we got a white interior in the Super and a gray interior in the regular. So Hot Wheels played around a lot with these this, uh, for that year. As you can see, the front grills are also different color. Obviously because of the interior. That is the Maverick Gruber, guys. Uh, Grabber, sorry. I keep saying Gruber. Next, we have the 66 Ford Fairlane. And this is just a gorgeous super treasure hunt, guys. Now, this one here, I do not have the regular for either. So, as you can see, 2012. And moving up through the years, I'm missing the regular versions of these cars. So I've still got hunting to do, guys. But this green paint is just gorgeous. The rims are perfect on it. This is just a beautiful, beautiful super treasure hunt. Okay, now the next one is definitely a fan favorite, guys. Number nine on the list. And it is the Honda S2000. Definitely a fan favorite, guys. A lot of people went crazy for this one. And why not? It's a gorgeous looking car. This one you have the matte black roof. And on the uh, hood we have uh, matte black mixed with the blue. And done in AEM livery. This car is gorgeous. And yes, I don't have the regular version. I thought I did, but I can't find it, which is a surprise. Next one, guys. I love this car. 69 Camaro and this gorgeous Spectra Flame Silver. The stripes are gorgeous on this car. Convertible, red interior, TH on the back trunk, red line wheels, deep dish, five spokes. 
This car is just gorgeous. Now, you know how much I love Camaros, guys. And I don't even have the regular of this one. So I've really got a lot of work to do, guys. Next, we have the Volkswagen Beetle kind of tuned with this huge engine coming out of the back. Now, this one I do have the regular version. I don't know where I put it. I have a carded version of this one, but it's an error. Now, I do have it somewhere. I have not been able to locate it since I've been renovating the room a bit. I moved a few things around and I haven't found this one again. So I have it buried in a box somewhere, guys. I'll probably post pictures on Instagram of it just to show you guys. Or maybe I'll do another video on errors one day and I'll show it to you. But anyway, this is the Super Treasure Hunt. As you can see on the, the roof, you have the TH. And the metal is in uh, the metal. The engine is done in metal. The pipe is plastic. But I would imagine the base would be metal. Nope, the base is plastic, guys. So the, the engine is a separate piece altogether. Love the white mags on this car. I think they're really, really cool. And as you can see, the tires are pretty wide. Crazy looking little beetle, guys. Crazy looking beetle. Okay, the next one definitely is a huge fan favorite, guys. Number 12 on the list. We have the Ferrari 599XX. This car is stunning. Now, this car goes for a hefty price on eBay. Very expensive car, guys. Even the regular version of this is up there in price. But why not? She's just stunning, this beautiful, beautiful super treasure hunt, guys. And till this day now, is still very highly sought after. Just a beauty. And this one, I do have the regular version of. And as you can see, there's quite a big difference. The Super got a black roof and trunk, and the regular did not. And the paint, well, the paint obviously is a huge difference, and the wheels a definite huge difference. But this is just one gorgeous Ferrari, guys. Now, number 13 is the Chevelle Wagon 1970 in this Fire Chief livery. Spectre Flame brown or bronze. You have the goldish mags. And just a Pretty, pretty cool looking super treasure hunt. And it is a huge difference than the regular. Color change complete. Definitely nice. Okay, now we're looking at number, what are we, number 14? We are number 14, guys. Two left. And we have the Focus, 09 Ford Focus RS, guys. And this one's pretty cool. I dig the livery on this. 
Gives it that rally look. Redline rubber tires. And the roof. You have striping on the roof. I got something stuck there. Goodbye. Okay. You have striping on the roof. Racing livery all over TH right beside the three. We do have a plastic base and rubber slick tires. Really cool little car. Now the last one on the list, guys, is the 2011 Dodge Charger RT in Fire Chief livery. And this Spectra Flame Red is gorgeous, guys. You've got red rims, slick reel riders. Are they slicks? I believe they're slicks. Nope, they're treaded. Treaded reel riders. Aurora Fire Department. This is a pretty car. And this one, actually, I do have the regular of as well. And it is right there. So as you can see, a big difference on this one, too. And the biggest difference, as you notice, from the regulars to the supers, is the stripe all over the top. So there you have it, guys. That is the 2012... Regular and super secret treasure hunt collection. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Till next time, be safe, be well, happy hunting, guys, and smash that subscribe button. Ciao.